How to Fix Engine Unavailable on Virus and Threat Protection. The built-in virus and threat protection engine in Windows offers protection against viruses and malware. But if the Windows Defender update fails to install on your device, you may receive an engine unavailable error. This video will show you troubleshooting steps that you can do to help resolve the error and fix the issue with the virus and threat protection engine being unavailable. But before we begin, we would appreciate it if you hit the like and subscribe button for more troubleshooting videos. First solution, restart your computer. You may encounter the engine unavailable error if your system fails to boot properly. To fix this, you can try performing a complete system restart to ensure that all programs on your system start correctly. Most of the time, a simple restart fixes issues on your computer. To do this, press Windows button, click Restart. Once computer completely restarts, check if engine unavailable on virus and threat protection still occurs. Second solution, run Windows, update troubleshooter, utilizing Windows built-in update. Troubleshooter feature can help fix errors on your Windows PC by detecting errors and repairs them if there are any. To do this, press Windows key plus I on your keyboard to open settings. Click update and security. At left pane, click troubleshoot. Click Additional Troubleshooters, click Windows, update under Get Up and Running, click Run the Troubleshooter tab. Windows Troubleshooter will now detect problems. Wait for it to complete. After Windows Update Troubleshooter process has completed, check if there are problems found. If troubleshooting couldn't identify the problem, click Close to Exit. Third solution, Restart Security Center Service. The function of the Security Center service is to monitor your system's operations and alerts you of any errors. However, it can potentially disrupt the virus and threat protection engine, causing issues to occur. Therefore, it is recommended to restart the service as a preventive measure against such errors to occur. To do this, press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open Run Dialog Box. At Run Dialog Box, Type services.msc and press enter. Scroll down and right click Security Center Service. Click Restart from the drop down menu. Click Close to Exit. Check if issue still occurs. Fourth solution Manually enable Windows Defender. Windows Defender offers supplementary virus protection to your system. Disabling Windows Defender can result in system issues. Therefore, it's necessary to manually enable Windows Defender through the command prompt. To do this, type CMD at the search bar located at the lower left. Click Run Administrator from the drop-down menu. At Command Prompt window, type the command SC Start Win Defend Enable and press Enter. Wait for command process to complete. Close Command Prompt window. Check if issue still occurs. Fifth solution, Run Windows System Scans. A corrupt system files is another possible cause for this error to occur. To prevent the error to occur, perform a system scan to check for any corrupt files on your computer. To do this, type CMD at the search bar located at the lower left. Click Run Administrator from the drop-down menu. At Command Prompt window, type the command SFC slash scan now and press Enter. Wait for scan process to complete. After scanning is complete, System File Check will automatically repair corrupt files if there are any. Next, type the command dism.exe slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health and press. Enter to run the dism command. Wait for dism process to complete. Restart computer. Once computer completely restarts, check if error still occurs. Sixth solution, change Windows Defender Registry. Key values. There are instances when the recommended number is not correctly set. Your computer will experience this error. To fix this, change the registry key values of Windows Defender. To do this, press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open Run Dialog Box. At Run Dialog Box, type Regedit and click OK. At Registry Editor window, click H key underscore local underscore machine. Click Software folder to expand it. Click Policies folder to expand it. Click Microsoft folder to expand it. Click Windows Defender to expand it. At right pane, click anywhere then click New tab. Click D word 32 bit value. Rename the first registry key to disable anti-spyware. Then click anywhere again, then click New tab. 
Click D Word, 32 bit value. Rename the second registry key to disable antivirus. Click on both registry keys and change each registry key values to zero. Check if error still occurs. I hope this guide has been helpful. Please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.